Assalamu alaikum guys how are you i hope you are doing good and today in this video i'm going to show you a full review of the latest havoc os havoc os which is the uh, based on android pi and security patch of this rom is 5 september 2019 and the havoc version of this rom is 2.9 official build so without any further ado let's get started <laughs> Starting from the home screen here we have the latest version of the launcher launcher with all uh, all new features and in the camera we don't have any MIUI camera or Gcam free installed we have this simple camera you can also install the pixel 2 or pixel 3 camera and the overall performance of this ROM is pretty good as you can see here the app opening speed of this ROM is also pretty good it is opening the apps quickly and the gaming performance on this rom is also pretty good and we also have the gaming mode in the quick settings as you can see here and now let's dig into the settings in the settings we have network and internet connected devices hovax settings in the hovax setting we have all the customization first of all we have the status bar in the status bar we have the double tap to wake and brightness controls quick pull down smart pull down and battery style android q is also included battery percentage battery bar and uh, notification uh, indicators and battery slider etc and in the quick setting you can change the row columns landscape portrait and uh, here we have some battery uh, buttons brightness buttons sorry and in the interface you can change the UI style to pixel or OSIP and uh, I am using the pixel right now and uh, in the background color you can choose the automatic light dark or gray or glossy and uh, you can also ch uh, change the accent colors you can change font styles from uh, font manager after it you can change the app icons uh, shape and uh, in the ambient display we have the always on display which is working fine as you can see here we also have the new notification and all available settings and in the screen we have the screen stabilizer and corners in the buttons you can manage the power button like advanced reboot lockdown screenshot on the go and the volume rocker buttons in the navigation bar you can enable or disable the navigation bar you can change the navigation bar mode and uh, in the stock settings you can ch change the gestures uh, here we have the pie gestures and uh, after it we have the pixel animations on the home button and you can also enable the one handed mode After it in the gestures we have the system gestures like jump to camera, activate the torch, swipe up on home screen, prevent ringing and uh, after it we have the swipe up screenshot, swipe up gestures and in the navigation gesture we have the one plus gestures and uh, edge gestures, pi control you can enable and touch them. After it in the lock screen we have the media cover art and double tap to wake and uh, lock screen shortcuts, lock, lock screen uh, clock style settings and uh, after it we have the recent here you can change the recent style to quick step, stock, grid, android go or slim and in the notification you can change the light settings and uh, heads up and we also have the in call vibrations and the notifications and uh, and the buttons we have this system in the system we have some system settings input method and uh, battery saving and in the mix we have at the top we have the gaming mode which is the advanced gaming mode to enhance the gaming performance of redmi 5 and uh, after it in the display we have the brightness level night light adaptive brightness live display wallpaper sleep rotation expanded desktop 
and uh, in the font size we have a lot of font sizes and uh, in the display size we have five types of display sizes and after it we have the VR settings, wireless with that and the sound quality of this ROM is pretty good and we also have the Mi Sound Enhancer uh, which is helpful to enhance the sound quality and uh, after it the security of this ROM is pretty good the fingerprint is working fine and if you want the face unlock then uh, flash the stock G apps and after it we have account accessibility system and uh, in the system we have languages and input date and time backup reset options multiple users and update and in the board phone you can check your android version which is the android pi and security patch of this rom is 5 september 2019 and you can install any custom kernel on this rom and uh, the hawk version have oak version of this rom is v 2.9 official build by sukrut so if you want to this is a uh, really recommended rom and fully stable rom so if you want to install this rom download the rom and gfs from the link in the description reboot your device into any installed custom recovery go to wipe wipe everything except the internal storage and sd card now go to install flash the download ro downloaded rom plus gfs and you will be in this room so if you like this video hit the like button don't forget to subscribe my channel keep supporting thank for watching peace